All right, here's a, here's a story that should really, really infuriate you, but you might not be surprised at all. And here, here is here's the story. Here's egalitarianism. I mean, the ultimate manifestations of altruism in full force. I mean, it's so disgusting, it's hard for me even to tell you the story. All right, so remember yesterday I talk, talked about math and how math scores are dropping, and we talked about all that. And then one of the, one of the things I, I mentioned was the number of kids enrolled in algebra classes has plummeted from like 34% to 24%, something like that. Um, yeah, 34 to 24% in the last 10 years. And, and we're kind of speculating on why that was and so on, but I didn't even consider the obvious reason why this is happening, or one of the obvious reasons why this is happening. And of course, none of the stories I read had this, but the New York Times, in a story about the phenomena, had this sentence buried in the story. No focus, no emphasis on it, but to their credit, they had their sentence. I didn't read any other news story that had the sentence in it, and it just, it, it, you just gasp when you read it. Here's the sentence. In some districts and states, notably California, there has been a push to equalize math education by placing fewer eighth graders into advanced math. <laughs> so the reason there are fewer kids in algebra classes is because some states and some counties and some districts have chosen to hold back kids in math for the sake of equality. Hold back kids. I mean, is there anything more evil than this? I mean, really? I mean, I guess mass slaughter and stuff. But, but short of slaughtering thousands, millions of people, is there anything more evil than holding people back restraining their potential, not allowing them to advance at the rate they want, can, could, keep them back, not because somehow it's good for them. No. I can't imagine how that would be good for them. But because it's good for the other kids, they don't, I guess they don't seem out of line, that the kids that are slower, for the sake of the slow kids. I mean, one godless monkey says, like cutting off LeBron's legs. Yeah, but in, yeah, I mean, oh God. I mean, it is LeBron. But, but there's a sense in which this is more evil. Because this is the mind. And this is on scale. This is thousands and thousands of kids who could be getting algebra in thir in, 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 at a certain age, at 13 years of age, and, and they're not going to. And, and this is just happening in one class. What about... The books they read, what about the science they study? What about everything else? They just throttled it down. Let's make people dumber. Why? Because some of us are dumb. So we need to make the ones who are not dumb, dumb. And, and this is the point of egalitarianism. It's not about money. It's not about wealth. It's about everything. It's just about making you equal and, and ultimately the way we're unequal is primarily about the mind. So therefore, we have to find a way to throttle the mind of some in order to... It's not in order to benefit somebody. Nobody benefits from this. Nobody benefits. It's just to penalize the able. I mean, maybe they rationalize it as so that the dumb don't feel too bad about themselves. But that's not even true. Everybody knows. All right. I mean, that's just outrageous and disgusting. Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to iranbrookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one of those uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Iran Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and of course subscribe, 
press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.